Small saving schemes have been very popular in our country due to the financial security and the stability involved. Apart from being safe and reliable ways to save and invest, small saving schemes are preferred as they also yield attractive returns. Investors looking to grow their wealth or planning for their child's education, retirement or any other future expense must research regarding these schemes where they can earn the highest returns. So without further ado, let's find out how much return one can expect from every rupees 10,000 invested in these government small saving schemes. Hello everyone, I'm Hemant Abhishek and welcome to a brand new edition of Paisa Vasool, where today will tell you all about the interest rates of small saving schemes and where you can invest. Scheme number one, Public Provident Fund. So PPF is a popular scheme known for its tax benefits and long-term wealth accumulation potential. Contributions of up to Rs 1.5 lakh annually are allowed under it and the returns are entirely tax-free. It offers a fixed interest rate of 7.1% compounded annually, whereby an investor earns Rs 710 per annum for every Rs 10,000 invested. Point number two, National Savings Certificate. So NSC is a government-backed small savings scheme that provides a fixed interest rate and a safe investment avenue. The investment period for NSC is 5 or 10 years with the interest rate compounded annually. At 7.7%, the maturity value for Rs 10,000 NSC certificate is Rs 14,490 at the end of 5 years. Scheme number 3, Senior Citizen Saving Scheme. Designed exclusively for senior citizens, this is an excellent option for retirees seeking regular income. It has a tenure of 5 years with the option of extending it for another 3 years. At 8.2%, it pays quarterly interest of Rs 205 for Rs 10,000 coming up to Rs 846 per annum. Scheme number 4, Sukanya Samridhi Yojana. This one is a standout choice for parents looking to secure their daughter's future. It provides an 8% fixed interest rate and the scheme matures after 21 years or upon the girl's marriage, whichever is earlier. At 8% interest, it pays Rs 800 per annum for Rs 10,000 invested. Scheme number 5, Post Office Monthly Income Scheme. This scheme is tailored for individuals seeking a steady monthly income. It has a maturity period of 5 years and offers a fixed interest rate of 7.4%, which pays a monthly interest of Rs 62 for every 10,000 invested or Rs 744 per annum if you add it up for 12 months. Scheme number 6, 5-year term deposit. In the post office 5-year term deposit, investors can earn a return of 7.5%. It pays an annual interest of Rs 771 per 10,000 invested and the payout is compounded quarterly. Scheme number 7, Mahila Samman Savings Certificate. The MSSC gives a return of 7.5% that is compounded quarterly, returning a maturity value of Rs 11,602 after 2 years for every 10,000 invested. As you can see, each small savings scheme has its unique advantages. PPF is preferred for long-term wealth accumulation, the NSC for tax benefits, benefits and the Sukanya Samriddhi Yojana for securing a girl child's future. By carefully evaluating your personal goals, risk tolerance and investment horizon, you can make informed decisions and leverage these small saving schemes to achieve your financial targets. That's all for this edition. We'll return in the next video with some more wealth and investment tips and tax saving tricks. Till then, goodbye, take care and keep vasooling paisa because if it's not value for money, it's not worth it.